General Charles Cornwallis was a British army officer and colonial administrator who lived from 1738 to 1805. He was born into a wealthy and influential family in England and was educated at Eton and Cambridge University. Cornwallis joined the British Army at a young age and served in various military campaigns throughout Europe, including the Seven Years' War. In 1775, he was sent to America to fight in the American Revolution. During the war, Cornwallis played a significant role in several major battles, including the Battle of Saratoga, where he was defeated by American forces. He also served as a governor in British-controlled territories in America, including New York and Virginia. In 1781, Cornwallis led British forces to victory at the Battle of Guilford Courthouse, but was later defeated by American and French forces at the Battle of Yorktown. This battle was a significant turning point in the war, and ultimately led to the surrender of Cornwallis and the British Army. After the war, Cornwallis returned to England, where he was appointed as Governor-General of India. In this role, he worked to establish British control over the Indian subcontinent and to improve administration and governance in the region. Cornwallis was known for his military and administrative skills, as well as his personal integrity and sense of duty. He was highly respected by both his contemporaries and later generations, and was remembered as one of the greatest military leaders of his time. In addition to his military and administrative accomplishments, Cornwallis was also a committed member of the Anglican Church and was involved in various religious and philanthropic organizations. He was also an active supporter of education and the arts, and was a patron of several notable artists and writers of his time. Overall, General Cornwallis was a remarkable figure in British and American history, known for his leadership, military prowess, and dedication to duty. He left a lasting legacy as a brilliant strategist and effective administrator, and remains a prominent figure in the annals of military history.